Hey guys, it's Lovie here and welcome back to my channel. So today is a special day for me because it's my birthday. Yes, I am already 26 years old and yeah, I know, I'm that old. So today I will draw the winner of my previous giveaway contest that I had in my previous video. So if you have, if you didn't know what that is all about, please check it out. I'll be putting it right here. Here. If it's not here, then it's here. I don't know which part. So just click on that. And before that, I want to make this video a very special one because a lot of you have been requesting about my skincare. Because before, my skin was in bad shape. Like you can see every pimple on my face, even though it's layered with a lot of makeup already. So a lot of you have been asking me about my skincare routine, and this would be my skincare routine. So if you want to know how I care for my skin during day and night then please keep on watching. So I'll be starting off with my morning routine. I will just be discussing all of my routines so that this video won't be too long and I don't have the time to edit so yeah I'll just be discussing it. So in the morning what I do I use different sets at times. In the morning what I do is I wash my face with a facial wash and this is what I love that I've been using a lot lately and this is Pure Face from Hope for Skin and I would like to thank Hope for Skin Manila for giving me this product because I've been loving it. This is an organic um, facial wash and um, it smells really nice. I use this in the morning and night. Um, so what I do first is I wash my face twice so that's twice and if I had makeup on I use my I wash my face three times so in the morning I just wash my face twice so what I do first is I wash my face with Lily Touch um, Miracle Soap and this is the soap from Lily Touch and um, I've already cut a portion of it so what I do is I cut them in portions so that it will be um, it won't be a waste of products because it melts a lot so this is the first product that I use in the morning. I wash it with Lily Touch Miracle Soap. And then the next one is I wash it with Pure Face from Hot for Skin Manila. So I just um, rinse my face with this to soap. So when I am very satisfied with my uh, how I washed my face, then the next thing that I do is I use a toner. So in the morning, the toner that I use is this tea tree oil. Um, it's pure derm. So um, from pure derm tea tree pore freshener toner, and I really really like this because my skin is less oily in the morning when I use this one. And um, this is from Sally Yuri Melissa. So this is from Ate Melissa. Thank you so much for giving me these products to try on because my skin has been so fresh ever since I used this. So um, if you want to know how, where to get this Korean, this is actually a Korean product so if you want to know where to buy this, I will link the group below. It's a group where they sell all this amazing Korean stuff that came from Ate Marisa from Korea. So yeah, I use this as a toner in the morning and after I tone my face, I put a serum. So the serum that I use in the morning is this. Um, this is the tomato blush serum and I have been loving the effects of this. It smells so good. It smells like, it smells like candy by the way. So this tomato blush serum is what I use in the morning. This is good as a primer as well. So um, ever since I used this, my skin has been so... Um, it has a lot less acne and that is the best part about this one. So this is what I use daily before I put on anything else. I don't need any primers anymore but on special occasions I use, I use additional primer after this. So this is the serum. And then after I put the serum, when I go out I use a sunblock. So sunblock is very important whenever you go out because especially if you have a lot of acne like I had, it tends to scar if you go out under the sun. So what I use is this Sun Protect SPF 45. This is from Hope for Skin Manila again. 
So I love this one because it's not oily and it doesn't give you that white cast on your face whenever you um, take a picture. So I am using it right now on my face. This is so good. It's not oily and it smells amazing as well. So this is the sunblock that I use. And if you want to purchase products from Hope for Skin Manila, they have a lot of amazing organic products that you can try and you won't have any allergies at least or if you will um, because this is all because this is all organic yeah this is the sunblock that I use so after I put on my sunblock and then I am ready to add on some primers if I need it and then put on my makeup and I'm good to go so that's it for my day for my daytime you so that's it for my daytime routine so next, okay. So next, for my nighttime routine, for my nighttime, I use more products. So since at night there is a lot of makeup and then there is pollution and stuff. So what I do is the first thing that I do after I remove my makeup with a makeup remover. Okay, so if you're wondering with the makeup remover that I use, I use this Garnier. Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water, I put um, a cleansing pad, I put some on a cleansing pad and then I wipe off the makeup before I wash my face. So after this, I wash my face with, as usual, really such miracle soap and then after that, at night, I use this pore cleansing foam from Clinical Solution. Um, it's from Eat Skin. And this is from Sally Unimedicine Again, they sell amazing Korean products. So I use this and then um, I wash my face with this one for about two to three minutes. I massage the uh, foam on my face. I noticed that whenever I use this one, my pores are so clean and tight. Amazing. I love this. I love this so much. The next Okay, so after washing my face, the next thing that I do before I start off with all of... Okay, so after washing my face, the next thing that I use is this um, tomato blush toner. I used it... I use this one at night and sometimes in the morning. So sometimes I use it at, this one as, at night as well, but depending on the mood that I have. But the mo but mostly I use this at night. Tomato blush, uh, tomato blush toner. I noticed that my skin is less oily as well. It's very tight and and smells nice as well. So yeah, after I use this one, the next thing that I do is I use this this um, snail soothing gel from Lux Organics. And this gel is amazing. We bought it for. Um, 399 pesos from Watson's and it's buy one take one so the other one is with my boyfriend he loves it too because we, whenever we use this afterwards it, it doesn't leave your skin so oily as well so I love this snail soothing gel I also use this on the areas that I have sunburns or are on the tips of my hair sometimes so yeah that's it um, after this I use my current favorite my current favorite and holy grail is this Garrison 9 Complex. This is a Korean product and this is so amazing. I am so in love with it. This is just a box and when you open it, you will see the product. It is right here. So this is amazing. It has a little scoop right here that you can scoop the product on. So let me just remove this one. This is a coarse oil. And it's very popular in Korea right now because they love horse oil and um, it smells, it smells amazing. I cannot, ex um, I cannot explain the fragrance but it's very fragrant but it's not too overpowering. So this is the cream. I just scoop a little bit and then I massage it all over my face after I put on the serum. So um, I use this at night because it's very oily since it's a coarse oil. So if they say that don't use this if you have a very oily skin, I don't think that it's a good idea because this one I have a very oily skin 
I have an acne prone skin and whenever I use this one at night before I sleep, before I sleep, my skin absorbs every oil that it has. So yeah, it, it's very oily when I go to sleep. My face is very oily when I go to sleep. But when I wake up in the morning, it's not too oily at all. It's like my skin has absorbed all the porous oil from this product. So this is a big thumbs up. And if you want to purchase this one, it's from Silly Beauty Melisali again. So yeah, next. So after that, I use this Rapid X Lash and Brow Secret Potion from Hope for Skin Manila as well. And it's like, a, it has a spoolie applicator that you can just um, apply on the roots. And this is a Lash and Brow uh, Lengthener. So it will lengthen your eyelashes and eyebrows. So, so far I've been using this on my eyelashes and on my eyebrows and it's been good because I have noticed that my lashes are um, thicker than before and I'm still waiting for it to uh, grow. So yeah, this is the Rapid-X Lash. So whenever I have an acne or whenever I feel that I will have an acne on my face, I use this Acne Gel RX and this one is a spot treatment from Hope for Skin Manila as well. And so what it does is it inhibits the pimples from coming out and if you have already an existing pimple, it will dry your acne fast and but during my menstrual cycle whenever I will have my menstruation before days before I will have my menstruation I will have cystic acne like large acne on my face and that is a very sad that I know right sad have you ever felt that sadness that you don't want to go out because of that very large acne on your face? So what I use is this uh, Louvies. I think this is Louvies Vignette. Vignette. And this one is given to me by my aunt. And, and this one is given to me by my aunt from Switzerland, Auntie Anita. Um, this is an acne lotion. So I just uh, put this on the spots that needed to be treated and I feel a bit of a sting whenever I use this on my acne so it means that it's working and I've been loving this on my cystic acne um, but since this is a very small one I am <laughs> saving it for I'm just using this for cystic acne and for those uh, for the little acne that I have I use the RX from Hope for Skin Manila and once a week, I use a mask on my face, and this is the Aztec, Aztec, Aztec Secret. And I bought this from Healthy Options in SM Pampanga. And if you have any SMs near you, go check out the Healthy Options and then ask for the Indian Healing Clay. And it says that this is the most powerful clay or mask that you will ever use. So um, this is a mod, actually. This is a mod, as you can see it right here. Um, you mix this with water or apple cider vinegar. So what I do is I mix this with equal parts of apple cider vinegar and then I apply it on my face at night and I wait for it to dry and then when it's dry, I wash my face with lukewarm water and then I'm good to go. So whenever, after I use this, I see that my face is very red and it's like inflamed, but not that bad because it says in the instruction that it's very normal that your skin is going to be red after the, the uh, treatment. So um, sometimes I use this apple cider vinegar as well for my acne and I use this as a toner as well. I mix it with equal parts of water or uh, more water so that it won't be too harsh on your skin. But don't use this regularly. Just use this whenever you have a bad skin problem. So yeah, I drink this, I put it on my hair, and this one is so amazing. I love apple cider vinegar. Yeah. And twice a week, I use a sheet mask, and I'm very addicted to sheet masks. So these are my sheet masks that I have. I bought this from a Korean store. Whenever I go to my boyfriend's place in Pampanga, I buy a lot of 
of sheet masks because um, his showroom, their showroom for their furniture business, they are um, they have a Korean store adjacent to the the um, showroom that they own. So I bought these sheet masks. I use them. I use this twice a week. So I apply it on my face. So what I do is after I tone my face, I apply this sheet mask and then I wait for it for about um, 30 to 40 minutes and then I remove and then I proceed to and then I will go and proceed to the soothing gel, a snail soothing gel or the serum and then the horse oil and that's it. That's it. So that's it guys about my skincare routine and if I have a new set of skincare I will update you guys but so far so good my skin has been healing so nicely and I still have the scars but it's it's starting to get uh, lighter whenever um, I'm just sticking to the skincare that I have right now because it's organic and it's all safe for my skin so I don't have any breakouts as of the moment and the last menstruation that I had I only had one acne on my chin so that's very surprising because whenever I will have a menstru my menstruation I will have a lot of acne on my face so this time it's the first time that I did have breakout so far yes I hope this will continue and I will update you so next so let's move on to the most awaited part of this video which is drawing the winner of the giveaway. So I will get um, all of your comments are printed in a um, in a bond paper, a piece of bond paper and then I cut it out and then I put this in this plastic bowl right here and if you joined your comment is in this bowl and good luck. Yes. So I will just, to be fair, so I'll show you. Who will win this? Okay. Who is this? Who is this? Okay, so this is from Kim Loris, and she said, ha um, "She said, advanced happy birthday, Bo. I would love to see a five-minute makeup challenge. So congratulations to Kim Loris, and thank you so much for the greetings. Um, so you requested that I will make a five-minute makeup challenge, and since you are the winner, I will do that on my next video for you. And thank you so much for joining." I will contact. I will try to contact you on your email address, and then I will post this one on my Instagram and on my Facebook page as well. So um, you can contact me on uh, my Instagram or my Facebook page if you're watching this video as well. So yeah, and for those who joined, I'm so sorry if you didn't get picked. Um, maybe next time because I will be having a lot of. Um, giveaways in every milestone that I will have I will give a giveaway so yeah thank you so much I have read all your comments and I will reply to your comments as soon as I can as much as I can because I'm really really busy right now and we are preparing for my birthday and yes so thank you so much guys and I hope you enjoyed this video and till my next giveaway see you guys next time Bye! Love you! Mm.